The best way to beat inflation is to build more homes. Really love this Bloomberg article about Minneapolis in May. They achieved this coveted 1.8% inflation, and it's mainly because they built more housing. To caveat, they've also had virtually no population growth, which does help stabilize prices, but they've also eliminated zoning that allowed for only single family homes and have invested $320 million for rental assistance and subsidies over the past five years for their residents. So Minneapolis residents only spend about 40% and their income on rent, which is still pretty high. It should be around one third, but they have a really low misery rate and they're not spending all their money on housing and housing isn't skyrocketing in price and housing is a huge part of the inflation metric that we calculate. Minneapolis also has a low misery rate driven by low inflation, a low jobless rate with only Houston posting lower inflation as according to this Bloomberg chart. So that's good. Just build more housing and give people access to said housing. And the thing is, if people feel safe within their housing, they can go and get a job. It's this really virtuous cycle of growth 